Good evening, and welcome to the reveal of Kenworth's all-new medium-duty product line. I'm Kevin Bainey, Kenworth's general manager and PACAR vice president. Now, we've been posting teaser images and videos on social media leading up to this event, and we couldn't be more excited for this day to finally arrive. Laura Block, assistant general manager of sales and marketing, has joined me to celebrate this special occasion. Thanks, Kevin. It's great to be here in Phoenix. In February, we launched our next-gen T680 to rave reviews. That was a lot of fun. What is truly exciting about this reveal is that it is not just one truck, but an entirely new medium-duty product line. Laura, you are absolutely right. Launching an entirely new product line this year is truly special. Now, I want to start by thanking our customers and drivers. You are the ones on the front lines that continue to deliver goods and services across the U.S. and Canada throughout this pandemic. And we have the honor of being your support team, providing trucks, parts, and service through the world's best dealer network. I also want to express my heartfelt thanks to all the drivers that make it happen every day. I also want to give a shout out to our dealer network. We have the strongest dealers in the industry. We have 431 locations in the U.S. and Canada, and they have earned the title, the world's best dealers. In 2015, we established the Premier Care Gold Program, which sets the benchmark in the industry for service excellence. This program sets a high standard for service capacity and performance. Many of our dealers have joined us today, so thank you for being the world's best dealers. And one reason I'm so excited about this lineup is the amount of time we spent with customers defining how they use these trucks. You will see over the course of the event, and when you have the opportunity to drive them, how much the design team focused on the drivers who use these trucks every day to do their jobs. And our product development team put countless hours into developing Kenworth's new medium duty trucks that live up to our slogan, the world's best. This first video highlights the work put into developing the new medium duty product line. Before diving into the design process, we have to ask ourselves why. Having a guiding principle gives us purpose, and at Kenworth, our guiding principle is designing and building the world's best trucks for our customers. We already had a great product in the medium duty market, but to be the world's best, you can't stop there. You have to continue to best yourself and anticipate what customers' needs are in the future. When we set out to design the next generation medium duty product, it needed to live up to Kenworth's reputation. From best in class reliability, exceptional durability, and maximum vehicle maneuverability. As the public face of the customers that use these trucks, it became increasingly important to us that the next generation medium duty not only appear competent and professional, but also approachable and intuitive to use. And the bottom line was the new product had to be more class appropriate and cost competitive. Having just gone through the extensive design process to bring the T680 and T880 to market, we knew we wanted to offer all the benefits of that cab design to our medium duty customers. We also wanted to know everything that was truly important to our customers, so we invited them in to be part of the design process. By working directly with our customers, we learned what they wanted. And to achieve that, we needed to make the cab as low as possible. Some operators get in and out of their trucks 50 to 60 times a day or more. Making it as easy and as safe as possible was key. We also learned that we needed to minimize BBC to allow more flexibility for equipment spec'd on the back of the truck and to provide improved maneuverability. Moving the cab lower and farther forward required some design changes in the front corner of the cab. That has an engineering intensive area and we knew it was going to be a large effort to get it done. The voice of the customer convinced us that it was the right thing to do. Same with the cooling module, we needed to get it as low as possible to maximize visibility. It also needed to be versatile, a design nimble enough to operate in class five operations and hardy enough to compete in the class eight space. 
Once we had those big pieces defined, the designers got to work. From a series of sketches to digital data, clay models, and prototypes, we kept the customer's interests at the forefront. We involved them at every step. We had to analyze our competitors' pros and cons and fill any gaps in a better and more efficient manner. We completely tore down four competitive products to ensure we knew what the best-in-class product would need to be. We also completed competitive vehicle testing, which influenced our best-in-class targets for durability, maneuverability, driver ergonomics, and customization. By partnering with our customers from the start and conducting a thorough competitive analysis, we had a powerful strategy that served as a roadmap for the future. With hundreds of hours of customer calls, customer visits, and design reviews under our belt, we felt confident that we had established the right design criteria to build the world's best truck. We then began to build test trucks where we could simulate the real world conditions that our customers experience. Testing proved that we had a scalable, durable, and safe platform. And that approach paid off when we saw the customer's reaction to the new product. From the very start, our goal has been to improve safety enhance truck driver quality of life, increase efficiency, provide exceptional durability, and maximize vehicle maneuverability. We've asked and answered a lot of hard questions to get where we are today. It took a lot of effort to make this truck seem effortless for the driver, but we never lost sight of the why. To be the world's best, you have to bring the best to every step of the process. Truck drivers have an incredibly difficult job. Driving a Kenworth truck should be the easiest part of it. That only scratches the surface on what it took to make this new lineup a reality. Jonathan and the styling team, Joe and the engineering team, Phil and the validation team, and Judy and Shakib and the hardest working operations team in Canada, thank you for the dedication and commitment to make the new medium duty a reality. Now, the moment you've all been waiting for Let's see those trucks! I just love these trucks. Now let's see them in action. Rain or shine, dawn to dusk. Going to work is more than just putting food on the table. We go to work because there is pride in what we do. We hear the call and we rise to the occasion. We don't let up until the job is done, till the last light of day, till we accomplish the impossible. And then we keep going. The only way to get there is with the right equipment, the best of the best, trucks that stand the test of time and improve with every generation. And that's why we've been building the world's best trucks for almost a hundred years. Trucks with more possibilities to do what you love. Trucks that offer more opportunities to get the job done. Trucks you can rely on when you need them. We listened to drivers and designed new ways to make their lives easier and more productive. No matter what job needs to be done, what load to be carried. No matter what road to be traveled.
So get to work with the newly designed line of Kenworth medium duty trucks for every generation of worker. Fully customizable and built to fit your business and support your bottom line. With multiple chassis options and new seating configurations. All so that you can do your part in building the future. So that you can focus on the real work. Delivering on time and on schedule. So you can stand back and say, yeah, I was a part of that. So that you can be there when it counts. We connect people so they can cross continents. We cross industries to keep the world moving forward. From the toughest jobs to the most personal cargo. Kenworth medium duty trucks are designed to make life easy. Built to last. So yeah, it's not just work. It's who we are and who we've always been. The world's best. That video embodies what Kenworth is all about and has been for nearly 100 years, connecting people across industries to keep the world moving forward. Our trucks are designed to make life easier, built to last, trucks you can trust day in and day out. Our cast and crew of that video are not just actors, they are our own sales and marketing team. Let's take a closer look at the lineup and meet the drivers from the video. JT is our medium duty marketing manager. He drove the rental truck in the video. Tonight, he is driving the T-180 Class 5 state bed. Brandon, our vocational marketing manager, drove the T-280 Class 6 box van. It's perfect for lease, pickup, and delivery. Bree, our on-highway marketing manager, drove another Class 6 T-280 configured as a water truck. John is a district sales manager. He is here with a Class 7 T380 utility truck. And finally, Mixer Mike is the director of medium duty sales. He is with the light Class 8 T480 featuring our vocational hood. Thank you for all your hard work, creative ideas, and taking time away from your families to be here with us tonight. Laura, that was a great video. For all of you that are viewing this on social media, the family in the video is JT's wife and two girls. Here's my ask. The Next Gen T680 now has over 5 million views on social media. Since you're watching this new Medium Duty event, Please spread the word so that we can get over 10 million views. JT and Brandon also filmed a fantastic video highlighting all the new features, advantages, and benefits of the new product line. Let's see what they put together. I'm out here in Nevada test driving the brand new Kenworth T280 medium duty product. We're headed over to meet JT so we can learn more about what this has to offer.
So, what do you think? Great truck, man. Visibility is awesome. Turning radius was great. Now I see more trucks around me, so I'm, I'm going to need you to tell me about them. Yes, uh, these are our all new medium duty models that will be replacing our current medium duty lineup. Right behind you is our T180 Class 5. The one you drove is a T280 Class 6. So these two are non CDL. The one next to it is a T480V, which is our Class 8 vocational hood model. And right behind me is the T380, which is our Class 7. So how do these differ from today's medium duty that we offer? Besides the different look, there's a lot of things that we've changed. The truck was redesigned completely from the ground up. So all new exterior, redesigned interior, the all new chassis components, brand new fuel tanks, suspension, everything was redesigned from the ground up. It's great to hear. I'm looking behind me and I see two very similar trucks, but I know they're different. So can you tell me the difference? What, what makes a T180 a T180 and what makes this the T280? So you notice the hoods are exactly the same. You can see the T180 sits a little bit lower, better ingress, egress. The difference between the two models is of course, it's a class five, 19 and a half inch tires, and it's a 19 and a half K GVW. And this truck is also standard with hydraulic brakes. The other difference that you notice um, is the roof height. T180 has a low roof and the T280 has a raised roof. There's a four inch difference between the two. And this roof is used for cranes and uh, booms. And you can get either roof on either model. Okay, so basically if you're looking for clearance, you're gonna wanna go for the low roof. One thing I noticed on both of them, we've got this little antenna up there. Class 8, we obviously have Truck Tech Plus. Is that what that is? And that's exactly what it is. So all of our new mini -mini models will have an option for Truck Tech Plus remote diagnostics, just like our heavy duty models. So the fleets or even private owners will be able to keep track of their vehicle health um, online through our uh, Packard Solutions portal. That's great to hear. Can you tell me more about the hood design and the cab itself? the exterior of the truck. I mean, it's a very different looking truck. So what went into that? How did we, how, where did the cab come from? where did the hood come from? Absolutely. When we did the interviews with customers and drivers, one of the most important things they wanted is the bigger and wider cab to have three person seating. So we took our heavy duty 2.1 meter and we modified it to uh, fit the medium duty chassis. To match the wider cab, we had to redesign the hood but also keep the sloped hood for greater visibility. Combined with the wide hood, you have a panoramic view uh, in front of the truck and gives you better ground strike visibility. They both have the redesigned grill and crown. So the grill is still metal and we have a redesigned crown that'll be available in chrome or in malt uh, gray color. I'm seeing down here, we've got a radar and I'm assuming this is our Bendix radar. We've got a new dash inside the truck, and while I was driving it, I noticed a lot of safety features. So I'm assuming we've got Bendix Fusion available on, on, on the new medium duty product. So we have Bendix Fusion available on T370 today, and we are carrying it over to all the new medium duty models. So you'll be able to get Bendix Fusion on all of the models. You wanna hop inside and show me what, what's new on the inside of this Absolutely. thing? Absolutely, let's go. So as you can see, Brandon, we redesigned the interior completely. One of the biggest changes uh, we made is the brand new digital display, which includes a seven inch high definition display with customizable digital gauges. You can control the display using the controls on the steering wheel. This particular one is a multifunction steering wheel. The steering wheel itself has a telescoping and tilting feature, so you can adjust it as you need. When we move the ignition to the right hand side, we move the light switch to the left hand side, which is also easily accessible from the ground. The dash has been completely redesigned as well, including the new HVAC controls, which will give you an option to set the temperature. We have customizable switch locations 
as well as an option for a ram mount right here in this position. Tell me more about this bench seat I, that I'm seeing, JT. So this bench seat is the configuration that allows three-person seating. This particular one has a toolbox underneath, so it has a lot of extra storage for equipment. So now, let me show you what we have under the hood. So these new duty models will have our Packard PX7 and PX9 and the standard transmission on these uh, models will be our Packard TX8 8-speed transmission. We will also have a L9N natural gas engine available with air hoods as well. One of the things we paid attention to is to make sure that all of our pre-trip inspection components are on the driver's side and we repositioned the uh, windshield washer fluid to the frame rail so it's an easy re to reach location here as well. Notice that this has changed from current uh, medium duty. Yes, what we did is uh, we relocated the air cleaner to be uh, mounted over the engine. We also redesigned it so that the air, air filter is panel style and it's easy to replace. We also kept in mind that the uh, service time is important. We kept the uh, light bulb replacement down to under five minutes. We have a brand new cooling module that is uh, mounted a little bit lower between the frame rails, which allows us for this uh, for the slope for the sloped yeah. hood, yes. So I've seen the aero hood. What's this vocational hood got to offer? So if you notice, Brandon, this uh, hood sits a little bit higher. It's because the cooling module is mounted on top of the frame rails to give clearance to the front engine PTO. And that's for applications like snowplow or pumper trucks that mount equipment in front of the truck. Capability of this hood is you have full parent rail extensions to mount that equipment. The other uh, difference is the grill is mounted to the cooling module, so it's stationary. And the purpose of that is when you open the hood, it clears those components that are mounted in front of the truck. Another option that is um, only available with vocational hoods is 18 to 20k front drive axles for those off-road applications. Great, great to hear the different versatility, all the versatility we have in this new medium duty product. I've got one last question for you, JT. Yeah? Can I take the T480 for a spin? Oh, of course, here you go. This has been a great show. Yes, it has. We will start building these trucks at the beginning of the third quarter. Please reach out to your local dealer to begin specking. Thank you for joining us tonight. I wanna to leave you with one last look at this all new medium duty lineup.